Hello everyone and welcome to Retro Geek Gaming. Today we have a brand new game. It came out just yesterday <laughs> and it looks amazing already. Look at this, that illustration. It's called Let's Cool and it's a simulation game, city builder, school builder technically. <laughs> so I thought we could give it a try and see what it's all about. Definitely we're going to play in career mode. This is the first time I opened the game so we can explore it from the get-go together. Mm. Sakura Valley sounds very nice. Temperate weather, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh my god. That looks so incredible. I wonder if the game looks like that. That's really beautiful. Do you think this is in Japan? Letter from All Headmaster. Not an obsidian. Okay, the school you loved is in a bad state. Tried my best. Now it's up to you. Um, we are taking over the headmaster position. Ooh, <laughs> poor kids. <laughs> I'm hidden a treasure somewhere on the school grounds. Okay, if you revive our school, the treasure is yours. That is encouraging, although we will do it for education's sake. Okay, character creation. That's very cute. I like the the style. Um can modify the height, the weight. Let's do a little above average. Woo! <laughs> I'll say I'm probably average size. Oh, we can choose the name. This is always a difficult one. Let's just go for the standard channel name. We're going to be female, skin color, let's say something like that. We can, oh, <laughs> wow. I think that's, it's okay for now. We could use the standard one. <laughs> and what else can we customize? Uh, that's right here for hair color. I always go for something kind of like that. Red hairstyle. Oh, I could spend an hour doing this, but I'll try to be uh, efficient. I love that. I love that. Ah, I love all of them. They're so cute. Yeah. Yeah. Th I think this, this will work. And what is this one? Oh, clothing. Nice. Um, yeah, perhaps, perhaps. T-shirt. Yeah, why not? Suit. No. I am the headmistress, but I want to be a cool head. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's... Maybe. Mm. I'll go for standard. Um top and skirt and I think some um don't remember what these are called socks they're not socks and we can have also beards and accessories glasses Harry Potter glasses or square square glasses and I think we can't do anything with the portrait that's it next oh, oh this looks so good what can we do here we have the emblem the school emblem Mm, 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 mm. maybe something artsy like the main channel I do have the name because all of my games are called the same all of my cities and all of my organizations are always paradise I don't know why and we can also pick oh an outline I these are all so nice I, I don't know if I can choose something maybe we can change it later yeah, that's okay. That's like a victory thing. You can change the colors. That's all right. We don't need to change the colors, do we? Uh, maybe a blue. Blue. And the second one will be a darker blue. And those are okay, I feel. And we can choose the uniforms. The male school uniform. I guess we can customize it. Hmm. I really like this one that reminds me of animes. That's quite nice too or maybe something like th I think I yeah my school used to have something like that maybe yeah that could do can we choose the color no yeah but it's fine and we are done <gasps> and it's loading. oh this is so exciting it looks really good I really wanted to play a game like this I have been waiting for a game like this for a while because what was the last simulation game I played I think I tend to play those like top down, like the airport sim video I did yesterday. So this is pretty like advanced for me. Reminds me a little bit of um, what's it called? My time at uh, Porsche. Yeah. Oh, can you hear? Oh, hello. Are you the new headmaster? Yes, I am. I'm Miss Lin, your assistant. Awesome, I'm like an assistant right from the get go. Feel free to ask me for help if you encounter any difficulties. I will. I might not have a lot of experience, but I'll do my best. I will do my best too. We are a great team. Okay, should we do a tutorial? 
yeah, I think we should do a tutorial. Always a good idea. Okay, try moving the camera to patrol the school. Okay. Moving the camera. Use the wheel to zoom in and out. Nice. Oh, wow. Look at that. When I have a task to do, I get distracted and I don't pay attention to other things. Oh, look at the circuitry. Nice. Use the middle mouse button to rotate the camera angle. Okay. And click between F and R to switch floors. Something I didn't remember how to do yesterday in the other game. Is that a hole on the wall? Okay. Education goals. Uh, let me first introduce your goal. We must admit students from all the communities around us and satisfy their needs. That sounds fair and fun. Number two, have the students attend classes so that they gain knowledge points. Yes. Also, like, sounds like a good idea for school. Number three, throughout the week, teach the students so they can pass the exam. This is already stretching me out a little bit, <laughs> but we will take it very easy. We will pause a lot. Hopefully this game can be paused. So they can pass the exam for their preferred course types at the end of the week. It's good that they are studying the things they like. Number four, when students pass the exams, the school gains contribution points, which can be used to further improve the school. And we can increase the school level by renovating the facilities, admitting new students and more. Please gain a high score to up the level of the school. Let's aim to be the best. Yes, let's. All right. Now, first things first. I want to know if I can pause because I said this was going to be a relaxing. Yeah, there is a pause button there. Greetings, Headmaster. I will be your building consultant, Brick Johnson. Very nicely named. This building hasn't seen regular use in ages. I'm sure you don't want your students to see this place looking like a dump. No. Let's tidy it up first. Yes. Because we need a good environment to learn. Okay, we're going to demolish things then. What is this? What are you? Large clutter. Okay. Useless assets. Fine. We can go. Is it telling me to destroy the whole room yeah hmm, nice what about these other things in here what are you are you also clutter 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 i feel like i can get rid of all of those yeah it's not telling me to but let's start with a nice clean space i think that's there is a problem with that wall <laughs> that's not something we can delete and click to clear do we cl clear that room too Okay, nice. So what do we have? I don't want to follow the instructors. I want to look at everything. This game looks amazing. I've never seen a place this clean and tidy before. We can now focus on our first day. Yes, let's build a classroom. Okay. Build panel. So we have build, course, management, headmaster's inventory, and recruit. Build, facility, classroom. Look at that. Management office, research room, women's room, men's room, tea room, tea room, headmaster's office. Okay, classroom. I'm guessing based on that video there, what we should do is something like this. And then we can place the door. Is it adjusting to the grid? Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, that's nice because then I don't have to be too precise. And we need some furniture for the classroom. So uh, blackboard, podium and student desk. So we are in exclusive. I want to make sure I understand the interface. Let's place... Um, well, you will notice very quickly, but... Oh no, I wanted it to be in the middle. Or have two. Well, never mind. Never mind. And... I guess... Would you sit as a teacher right in front? Yeah. I think that's a good idea. And now we need some benches. How many students are we expecting? Do you think? Uh, increase? Uh, no, 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 that's fine. How do I know how many <laughs> students to add? Let's do uh, 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 six. I guess that looks like that's what they want. Okay, hello, I'm Edison Liu, uh, the school's teaching consultant. It seems like you're ready to recruit some students. Yes, we are. There. They are a school's foundation. Yes. Visit the local community to get started. Oh, wow. Oh, that's so nice. Her hair is cool. This is where the potential students of our community are gathered. There are lots of children in this community who can start in our school soon. We can establish an admissions office here so that students may send their applications. Send in their applications. This is good practice for my English also. 
View local students. Mod for admissions. Okay, admissions office needed. They want to study, but their finances are tight. Being poor does not mean lack of ambition. Helping them achieve their aspirations will get you more contribution points in their life. Okay. Establish admissions office. Yes. We can expect 16 people per week and we will need 900 uh, coiny thingies. Don't know what they're called in here. And da -da -da. science, humanities. Okay, that's great because I love both of those. And that's kind of what I did with my education. And we can choose, I guess, uh, who we want to, to accept. But in this case, obviously, we're going to admit everyone. Everyone is welcome in our school. Decide to assign your student to a classroom and pick a homeroom teacher. I think we'll need one more seat because there were seven, weren't they? Okay. Oh, assign all year one students into classes. Assign homeroom teacher. Let me to click here. Let's click here. Class members. Now, definitely need more chairs. Six. Oh, so I think is it telling me that because over capacity? So can we actually add more? Uh, da -da -da -da. How do I find? Doors, staircase, no. Facility, no. Furniture, light stores, hygiene, temperature, security. Mm, can I duplicate this? Maybe? Uh, no, do, 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 do. I'm sorry. I should know how to do this. Maybe there's only six, six uh, students accepted. Oh, I see. So if we click on the room and then we edit the room. Here we can see the desks, and I think I can probably add, let's add a few more just in case we get students. And why not a lunchbox holder? Because that sounds really nice. And we actually have some other things we can add. Uh, standard appearance chart. Yeah, okay. Flower beds, school flag, clocks. I would like a clock, but one we can like hang on the wall, ideally. Pavilion, wow, stone lion. Maybe, maybe a lemon tree in the room. <laughs> yeah, and I guess we can click on that, and that means we are done with the decoration. So now we need to add the new person by clicking somewhere on here. <laughs> I suspect. Mm -mm -mm -mm. No recruit. So it's telling me that there's. There is someone who's not selected. So if you, I can assign you to class one one. There we go. And now we have everyone in there. Homeroom teachers are needed to manage students. Otherwise, the students will have disciplinary disciplinary issues. Now assign teacher to the class as their homeroom teacher. This is not a concept I'm too familiar with. I think Miss Link, because this is not a teacher, a teaching teacher, right? This is like a Oh, she is a humanities teacher. Maybe I will just let this be. <laughs> Class preparations are now complete. Yeah, let's unpause. Mm, okay. And let the school activities continue during daylight hours. Students and teachers will come to start a new day of life at school. That sounds great. Click the button to start the time. Okay, are you ready? Three, two, one, start. Oh, birdies. What is that? We have more clutter. Bye bye clutter. Headmaster, headmaster comes to the school gates to welcome the new students. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oops. Hi. Are you a student? I will pause immediately. Rick Evans, welcome. Tuition. That is not a tiny tuition. And we are welcoming the students. Miss Lynn is here and Retro Geek. Not for might not be rich, but we will never lose to anyone when it comes to a thirst for knowledge. Great. You are so good to us, Headmaster. Thank you. Paradise really is the hope to change our lives. Also mine. This looks so great. Let's rotate and take a look. We have a hole in our school. Look at that. I think... I don't know if that's conductive to learning. <laughs> Hope we can 
repair it soon. I mean, we do have some cash, but it didn't. The tutorial didn't tell me I had to repair things, so I want to be obedient. The students are all ready to learn. Let's plan out their brand new life at our school. Now, let's see. Course. These are the estimated exam results for the students in this class. You can make adjustments as needed. Oh, my God. What happened? Okay, we're not going to. We're not going to read all of these. Let's see. We have some academics. We have some sports. Four different types of courses. Okay. Uh, there are aspirations. So someone with athletic aspirations will need sports courses, and those that want to learn robotics will need science. Makes sense. Uh, the estimated exam results are displayed at the right. Yeah. Okay. So. Some will be estimated to fail, some to pass, and some to get full marks. At the moment, from what I can see here in the back, everyone is estimated to fail. <laughs> and current knowledge points. So there is what they have and what we should get to. That will give us contribution points. And when they finish, they will go up by a year. Awesome. That sounds good. So next schedule. Next, we will need to schedule call courses oh, <laughs> it's difficult to read next schedule courses to ensure students are able to achieve the passing mark okay select the course you wish to schedule then press or drag it to add it to the schedule so humanities um period one two three four monday okay what does that mean how many should i schedule uh, schedule one week of courses for any class. Okay, so let's do literature, science, arts. Oh, we don't have teachers yet. So maybe we only need to worry about these two. Um, hello? Mm -hmm. It did tell me to schedule more, so I'm guessing maybe we just need to hire more teachers. I had to press for it to do oh, also I'm going to teach them science I like that <laughs> art 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 and art, ooh, and art and then the last thing of the day will be sports mm -mm -mm, mm -mm. okay so that's done we got the 20 but we don't have a teacher I am guessing it will tell me to hire someone Again, I don't want to like skip ahead, but <sighs> um, recruit members. Recruit. Uh, do you think they just want us to do all um, science and literature? Because um, let's see what it says once we do this. So, schedule courses to ensure an estimated pass rate of seven students ay, ay, ay. what does it mean why is nobody passing anything maybe it's because they need to have more classes of the same things so we can do literature there oops oops uh, there no ah ah what is happening Maybe I should do things a little slower, right? I'm going too fast. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, look at that! Okay, now they are passing. Excellent work. Thank you. And we'll complete the week. Oh, if you put two of them, I think... Momento. 18. So they're happy with that? Alright. Uh, uh, why can't I just add one more here? Because... Otherwise, this goes into like an advanced course. Okay, I think that's all right. And let's press play again. Oh, we still need two more. What does it mean? Uh, uh. So it is locked. Maybe it will get un. Oh, here, here we go. It's going to explain locked curses. Found in the schedule are new courses that have not be un been unlocked through research. Okay. Okay, we'll get to that. Whew. They are looking at things. And the class has started, I think. Oh, wow. Mm. 
Awesome. There is a butterfly inside the classroom. Uh, that's me. Where am I going? Train teacher assign. Okay, we should be patient. Let the kids learn. In here, nice. In the meantime, we can see what's down here. Number of staff, number of students. We can bring more students in, I think. And here, up here, we can see the timetable. So first period. Mm -mm -mm. And I'm guessing maybe we could go faster. Do we have a, like a current mission? No tasks assigned. Okay. Oh, we learned something. Oh, something is happening. Matthew Allen, headmaster. <laughs> I had a boss called that. Oh, where is where is the message? Hang on. I had a notif where is my notification? Oh, oh my god. Hatch this egg for a cat. Uh, okay. <laughs> um, what was that? I'm tempted to like stop the video and go take a look at what that actually said. <laughs> there's nothing in there. There's nothing in here. They wanted something. Who wanted something from me? What is happening? I think it was something about recruiting someone. Humanities teacher, science teacher, maybe another teacher for one of the the same classes. I don't I don't know what to tell you, game. What's happening? Oh, here you are. I bet I bet you can like see that and think, oh my god, just click click on him. <laughs> uh where is your message? What do you want? Mail packer no. Um information of course relationship source i did my homework did you make me click on you just to say that you did your homework there we go i'll have to edit all of that i think <laughs> the room is so dark that i can't see anything headmaster can you please install a window to address the issue yeah um i'm but head headmaster mistress person um i didn't put any windows in is this a Hollow out, no oh, interesting. Doors and windows, doors and windows, floor to ceiling, wooden window, large window. Let's do one there and maybe one there. Oh, that's nice. Okay, I wonder if those little eyes meant that they couldn't see. No, probably not. It's all that it's not dark anymore. It's fine, it's fine. Mm. Provides great lighting, so plus four light. Are you still unhappy? Don't be unhappy. I'm trying. Do these windows not count as part of the classroom? I bet they do. Um, da 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 da. Funds. Okay. Thank you. Community donation. Build windows to fulfill class light lighting requirements. So probably this means that we just need more of them. So let's see. Maybe one here. Oh, there we go. And I think we'll do one just to be symmetric. And that's our window done. So what can we see here when we look at the detail of the class? There are some costs. It's not it's not a very aesthetic room, is it? <laughs> we should definitely add more decorations. I mean we have a butterfly. What classroom has a butterfly? Oh the butterfly left. Oh there it's back. And we're finishing period two. I don't know if I should go too fast. Okay. Hello, headmaster. I am Miss Sweets, the school's lifestyle consultant. That sounds so cool. Cool position. The students require a tea room so that they can, ha so that they may have drinking water. You should do your best to satisfy all requests to ensure a good quality of life here. Definitely. Build and keep a two tea room operating. We're going to pause again, because as you know, I need to process. And we're going to create a tea room. Buildings. Wooden structure. Does that mean... Oh, facility. Tea room. Where do we want to place our tea room? And are there any requirements? Mm, I don't think there are any requirements. So I'm thinking maybe we have it close to 
the classroom maybe like here hopefully that's big enough and oh, we need to repair those things i'm gonna have the door yeah uh there so people that go in can see it from there and they will have to walk a little bit so we have we need hot water flask hot water station cup rack and drinking water hot water station will cover the hole in the wall <laughs> with the station then we need some cups what is what is that oh oh it's a kettle and what I think I made a mistake but that's okay we can have both of them like that so that was the kettle and the water I think I clicked on the wrong thing and that is not done because we need to decorate a little more like can we do anything about this oh look at that so we can move it can we delete it no we'll move it outside of the room <laughs> it is letting some light in which reminds me that I should put some windows in here and da -da -da. it wants big one that is so cute okay decoration maybe that's for the outside i suspect we'll have another plant why not and we don't need chairs or anything like that since we can also have an a lamp i feel like we should have another lamp yeah that looks nice oh Ah, okay. Oh, we can have things to... I'm thinking it will probably ask us to do this at some point, so we're not going to jump ahead like I always do. You have built the tea room. Finally, students can quench their thirst. Thirst. Why are there so many capitalized words? It's like German. Hydration is very important. Yes, it is, miss. And now we go back to the play. What are these buttons? Who are you? Miss Lin. Who is teaching? Oh, I am teaching. <laughs> and what's happening here? That's my office. And I have another tiny office and... There's a... Oh no, that's so sad. Look at the toilet. Are you going to the toilet? Okay, that's it. I think I'll build some nicer ones soon, I promise. What is all of these? Just clatter, clatter. Concrete pipes. No, 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 no. Uh, 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 uh. Look at all the mix of things. That, and there is a lamp right in front of the door. I cannot allow this lamp. You go there. Oh, my poor school. What's happening now? Everyone is having their tea. They did have their tea already. And let's look at these things up here. So these are the points we have. And I'm... Um, I wonder, I wonder if these are points that are available and I take them because why would I have a hundred art and sports? We shall see. Oh, I like how everyone's resting. Oh, there's a little well too. Very nice. It provides drinking water. It's helpful. I love that there is also an animal uh, in the, the, the like the the class. And we can see the stuff. So the tough stuff is relaxed. That's great. Here we can see what we have completed. Excellent. Let's go fast and finish the day. A day of hard work, learning, and tea drinking. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Love the trees. Can we? I wonder if we can plant trees. Yeah, cherry trees. It makes me want to go to Japan. Nature calls the students need toilets. Yes, please hurry. Okay, let's pause then. And do we have a task for these? Or are we just icing it? Um, improvising. Okay, women's room. I'm guessing a women's room is a toilet. So there are three, three. I feel like maybe we can place them here. Yeah, it will be quite big, but... Um, these rooms are very useful <laughs> and we need some stalls should we have them side oops oh oh my god oh what is that oh the clock how do i go back back down it was no let's click the button sorry about that so i want e to rotate we're gonna have one two three 
and <clears throat> we are in, we're gonna add another plant <laughs> i love plants and we are not paused are we no no cancel okay there and then did we need the boys bathroom toilet with that there same layout as the other one and you are also going to get a flower that wall is really nice and we are done yes let's go back to our class love the little icons and why do we have a notification thingy there challenge Ooh, new facility oh let's again not jump ahead and recess is coming what do we have here period break and another break oh i guess yeah for for us the teachers and head people okay bye thank you for attending our classes oh Oh no, he has to wait. We should definitely add more more stalls then. We can edit it and add one more. And then we will edit this one. Uh, and add one more. Then. Now you don't have to wait. Awesome. No things still? Mm. Not sure about that. Maybe we have to research it and unlock it. We have some student applications. Oh, that is tempting, but remember that we have um, we have some what is it called uh, to make sure that they can actually pass the, the class headmaster's office and staff training room can now set training plans remember to train your teachers to increase their proficiency okay open course increase a teacher's proficiency through training let's choose miss lean oh can't really see that menu as a whole mm. uh, we can increase we can choose what to increase teaching proficiency management or research i think teaching should be good and we just got our first achievement and hi mandy <laughs> training has started after some time the teacher's proficiency will increase so am i guessing correctly that the teacher is using this break to learn i wonder if they always do that uh, at the end of the day or not I really want to fix that wall. How do we fix the wall? Crack in the wall. Maybe I can just build. I mean, they are using it to go in. <laughs> after school. Oh, the, right. We don't have any activities after school. But let's finish the first day. Let's go a bit faster. And. Dun, dun, oh, I love the bell. They came back to. Oh, to pick up this, the things. Interesting. I don't know, schools are so different all around the world, so this is a very different school to what I I uh, did. <laughs> Students are heading home. The first day of school is about to end. Have you gotten used to the school yet? Let's work hard and be the best school ever. Yes, I agree. So now we should finish the day and I'm hoping... Oh, I thought it would tell me like how well we did. So we spent some money. We still have loads and it seems like we are about to welcome students again let's see what's around here oh look at that oh this is where i'm recruiting people okay so let's quickly take a look at what our students have learned yesterday we have our students here so they have four points and five points and we need them to have 14 i think from what i can see five five some have five some have four mildly stressed what can i do to make you feel better mm, oh maybe she's no she just started she's already stressed and in the day i just started okay we will see uh how we can help let's start the next day let's welcome our students paradise school hello fire truck and uh, here comes me <laughs> Can I train myself? I guess I can't train myself. Maybe I should uh, wait for the end of the day. They pay to go in. I feel a little bad about that. But I think it's a scholarship. And what about this recruit and student admissions? So I feel bad like rejecting people. People want to learn. 
Okay, so I feel that what we should do is first of all add some more uh, of these desks because oh, no, go back. There is no harm in having a few more spaces. We are not committing to anything yet, and this way we can then decide if we want more students. Now we can also try to see um, how our levels change if we add one person, for example. So let's try with here yeah, recruit. So let's suppose we add they're all the same people, right? Let's just go for the first one. And then we need to assign this person to the course. Is that from management? No. Is that from here? Um do 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 is this so difficult? Not edit current year where are my people's stats knowledge stats uh, no, 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 class members. Ah, oh, stuff. People. Oh, here. Uh, we are going to assign this person, and we should see then whether this changes. Now, where was it here? Hmm. A little lost. Let's see. We added that person to the class. Did this change? Now there is one estimated fail because this person hasn't learned yet. They won't have, yeah, they won't have enough time. So um, maybe we remove them from for now, and we might have to let her go. <laughs> Can we just keep you around and not send you to class? No, we can't. That would be very bad. Okay, let's. Let's try like that. I'm gonna skip to the end of well, not to the end of the day, but we're gonna skip to the next day. I also want to save. Yeah, let's add a new one. We'll call it zero zero one. Simple. And continue. Training course is complete. Cool. We're not going to continue the training, but we might train the other teacher. Yeah, I know there is one student that is not assigned. What should I do? Well, I am responsible for this person now, I guess. Go to class and try to learn a little something. <laughs> and what's happening here? Satisfaction. Someone has a question. What is your question? I'm starving. Is there anywhere I can buy some food? Okay, food tent. We will need to research it. Okay, here we go. Uh, not enough food. Oh, we have like a new layer that explains whether our people have any needs yes uh, we need what am I looking at I'm a little lost okay new courses new facilities new furniture can be along through research we need research and I think I should click the way where you explain how to do this <laughs> I feel our oh, research room there we go 18 squares can we actually build a room if we don't have a building I don't think so so we're gonna make this a little bigger and uh, da, 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 da. yes so what happens now do I actually need to uh, oh there there we go it's gonna be built okay oh look at that we get more applications I know I want to help but let's just do one week where we don't really hire or accept anyone else just to keep the quality <laughs> just to keep the experience for the rest and uh, da, 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 da. come on come on come on we got our research room now now we can build a facility research it did have a minimum dimension right it said something about having a minimum direction 18 squares so that's four by i cannot calculate think it might be okay I'm gonna have the, the door a little further away from the rest we need a chief researchers desk a planning board and seats so none of these have like those areas requirements that we've, we had before I have that we're gonna have one desk one of these thingies and the board and the filing cabinet, yes, definitely need one of those to keep all of our valuable research. 
and we're gonna play some decorations like that inspirational decorations is this an actual castle <laughs> where do we build a castle i also like this fear it's like a those uh, things you use for um see in the future i'm not very good with words i think i will do this room and then maybe we will research a few things and finish this video save some things for the next one there are exp experts in every field research <laughs> oh my god there are experts in every field research tests the teacher's research proficiency that was hard to read research Test the teacher's research proficiency. We can recruit a new teacher to take on the research role. Yes. Now, it's telling me to recruit this person because it has a uh, science certificate. And what about the rest ones? Okay. Now we got a person, the ideal candidate. And all we need to do is assign him here like we did before. And to begin research, select a research goal. For now, select food tent as it can solve, resolve hunger. Resolve hunger. Oh, and now we have a new menu, new button. Okay, food tent. Oh, ho, ho, look at that. That looks great. Going to research food tent. It takes 1.2 days. Research has started, and this one person is required to work in the room. Okay, if you have more researchers, it will take less time let's let's see what is happening here why do we have oh because it needs more light really but i gave you a window and light <laughs> okay furniture lights maybe an incandescent light that doesn't sound very good and let's just add maybe the windows are too small maybe we need bigger windows Let's see. Yeah, now we don't have an issue with light. This is good to know. Now I understand what this means. <laughs> if you want to build a first class school, you can work hard in many different directions. Let's work hard for the future. I agree. Okay. I want to educate the best of the best. That doesn't sound very um, nice. Friendly. I want students from all over. I like that. I want to build the most beautiful school. Now, I am... I, I'm not going to do the, the, the first one, I think. Not at this point. We don't want excellency yet. I want to be welcoming, but I also want to have a beautiful school. <laughs> Let's say students from all over. And work hard towards it. Current level tutoring. Victory. So now we have a victory goal. And we can add the specific things that we need to do to a list. So we can keep track of our progress. Excellent. So we'll need <laughs> 50 or more students. No problem. Um, as long as they can pass the exams. I'm guessing we need to hire more people, but maybe first we should ensure they can eat something. So I'll tell you what, we're going to leave this here for now. Is this a good place to stop or should we maybe finish researching the food? We'll, f we'll wait for the food to be done. And then we might build a cafeteria. No. Expand our outer wall. We'll leave this for next time. We'll leave the, the restaurant for next time. Because I want to see what you think about this game. Whether you think it's a good, day, good idea to play. And uh, yeah. And I'm excited to like see what else we're going to do here. I think this is, this is a very beautiful. Very, very beautiful game. I'm very excited to play it. So thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one very, very soon because I think we're going to play this a lot. <laughs> okay, bye bye. Let's confirm this, save the game and in the meantime, see you. Bye bye.